Hey guys, it's Stacy. Welcome back to my channel. I'm super excited to record this video like all my other videos because this one is pretty special. I am getting two pups and this is going to be the puppy haul. I want to show you guys a picture. I'm going to pop up some pictures on the side of them the growth and everything so this video you won't see them in this video but you will see them in the next video i'm just going to show you guys everything that i bought them in this video and they're going to be house dogs we've never had house dogs before i am allergic to dogs but apparently yorkshires or i don't understand how they're hypoallergenic but it says that Yorkies are hypoallergenic because the hair or the fur or whatever you call it is, uh, is close to human hair. So you're probably wondering what about my other dogs that I have and the bunnies and all of that. So I'm just going to give a short story time. What happened was the two bunnies were rehomed and my bunny video was literally the most hated video out there. Literally. Everyone was attacking me for every single thing that I did. But... Um, I don't have the bunnies anymore because they are home. And my two dogs, Kelly and Bruno, he is a boor bull with or a boxer. He's a boxer and a pit bull mix. And then the girl is a Jack Russell. But we lost them in the same month. Um, actually, we lost the girl first. And then three weeks later, we lost the boy. And she was quite old. She was 13 years old. And he was about seven or something years old. We're playing it. We're only going to get a puppy like in two years' time. And then we decided. You know, my mom always wanted a Yorkshire Terrier and we, I looked on Gumtree and all other places and I found a breeder or a lady that's selling pups and she has Yorkshire Terriers. We already have a name for her and we were buying her things. This is basically, I'm going to show you in this video what we bought her. I was at the shop, I was buying her things and then like two weeks ago we decided why don't we get the boy as well so we're getting two Yorkshire Terriers and I'm gonna show you guys everything that we bought them in this video I'm super excited for we got them really cute things and I'm gonna show you guys the setup where they're gonna sleep it's gonna be under the roof but I'll show you all of that in this video so without further ado we can get straight into this video and don't forget to follow me on my socials to keep up to date with what I'm doing and some cute posts of the pups. Okay, so I have everything laid out over here and I'm gonna show you guys what we're getting our pups. I think I'm gonna insert the video right here and show you guys the growth and how they look right now. So let's carry on to this video. So the first important thing is where they can going to sleep. So I have a whole section set up. I think I'm gonna insert a video of that as well. This cage we got for when we had the bunnies. But since we no longer have them and we had a new cage made for them, it was just in our garage. So I took it out, washed it and assembled it together and made this huge space for them. And then we also got a bed. The first bed I got is this one. I got this bed first. Uh, it's a grey and pink one. With, we can like switch the sides. But I'm not... I thought we were going to get one dog at first. So then I took the pink one and then we decided we were going to get two. And then I have to get a bigger bed. So let me just show you guys the bigger bed. Uh, ow! So this. It's huge. It's like a whole couch. It's from Dog Life. It's really good quality. And it's all 100% washable. Fit in here. So now that we have the sleeping place. We're going to carry on with um, the accessories for that sleeping place. And that's where the blankets come in. Sister got this one for Leo. And then I got this one for Lola. But that's before I found out we are getting two dogs. So I will get a new one. But this is made for dogs. I don't know why they say it's made for dogs. I think any blanket can work for a dog. And now I'm going to show you guys the toys. And no, should I leave the toys for last? I'm going to show you the toilet things, if that makes sense. So let me show you guys that real quick. So with, the research, with the research that I've done, uh, Yorkies are prone to ear infections. And then I got them this pet wipes. It's fragrance free from Woolworths. And then I got the ear wipes. That's just for the ears and for the, and for the eyes because I know they tend to tear a lot in the eyes. There's like black lines by the eyes. So that's sorted for the ears and eyes. Okay, call me crazy, but I know it's what majority of people do. We bought doggy toothpaste and a toothbrush. So I think it's a bamboo. It's biodegradable. There's a bamboo handle. It's BPA-free, eco-friendly, and it's from recycled packaging. 
we got that and then we got the big dent toothpaste I think we have to start from a young age so that they'll be used to it then we have another one which is the pet paw and nose balm okay now for grooming I'm not sure what brush is the best for Yorkshire eyes because I haven't had a Yorkshire eye before I've only had a Jack Russell and a box pitbull crossbreed it's called American pitbull I don't know but I never had to groom my dogs before so this brush looks kind of serious I don't know about this brush so we just gonna see how the fur looks and what the um, groomers use and then we will get the brush as well but I doubt we will use this I'm not sure we're gonna go on to the harness and leash so the brand I chose for my dog is this brand rugs we got a paw and then my mom and my numbers at the back this is a small so hopefully it will fit them and it's a step in harness which is really cool because I did research and they said having a collar on a small dog is really bad and um, skip 10 seconds if you were a sensitive person um, I watched a video that said this couple had a pup and they put a collar on the dog and when they went to the dog bar a big dog ran past the leash and it broke the dog's neck so yeah I won't be doing collars this is the leash that I'm using it's not very long so I love that it's nearby me so that the dog doesn't feel like she's taking me for a walk and then my sister got the Dog's Life brand. She has a mini pooper, so she decided to get Leo the mini pooper one, which is super cute. Okay, next I'm super excited to show you guys this. It's so cute. Um, I'm gonna show you the food bowls. We're not sure what food yet. We're deciding between Bob Martin and Royal Canine or Cannon. I'm not sure how you pronounce it. But we got them Licky Mats. But Lola this one and then today we got Leo this one. So that's super cute. They can have their own licky mats. I never thought of any of the stuff when I had my previous two dogs. But we decided we're going to do things right. We have them on pet insurance. We have everything sorted for them. Okay, the next thing I got also from Woolworths is the silicone can cover. So when I buy them canned food or whatever food, I can just put this can cover on top. And the fridge, the fridge won't smell like whatever's in that can. So we didn't get pet carriers and we decided we are they going to get this cute little bag. So this one is going to be Lola's and this one's going to be Leo's. And it's super cute because all you do is put it on your shoulder and the little heads will stick out there. So I really like this, it's super cute. We got these three bowls as well which came with it. Oh and I forgot to show you guys. Inside this bag there is like a this hook thingy, leash thingy, so they won't go like falling everywhere or coming out if you're driving with them. And then we got the we got an anti anti oh wait no no sorry we got an ant proof bowl. I'm almost with the fun stuff, don't worry, I don't wanna bore you. But now we're just gonna get to the training part of everything. So the pet shop that we went to suggested that we get the puppy trainer. It comes with 10 free puppy pads, training pads. Um, I don't know how I feel about this one because I act, they are gonna be house dogs like I said. But I actually wanna train them to go outside. But since they are puppies they can't and we're gonna get them at two months which means they can only hold the bladder for around two hours. I think, I don't know, it's just the research that I've done, so I don't know, I can't wake up every two hours to take them outside, so I think I'm just going to put this out at night, and then, yeah, and then they also suggested this house training spray, what you do is you take the puppy trainer, the spray, and you spray it all over, basically some scent of that makes them want to urinate on here instead, I don't know how, super weird, but I'm going to potty train them. Okay, now to the fun stuff. So I'm going to show you guys the last things, which is the toys and the clothes. Before I show you that, we got them this as well. It's a travel size water bottle for them where you just click this button over here and water will run out. And then if there's still water left, you can just click the button again. And this hole over here will let all the water drain back again. Our neighbor actually has a Yorkie as well. And... Um, she has a toy pig 
and she was always biting this pig so my mom thought it'd be super cute to get our Yorkie as well um, a pig and I don't, I'm gonna take this away at night because I honestly don't want to hear a pig in the middle of the night so this is the one toy that we got them and then I got Lola this when we still decided on having one dog I got Lola this and then today we got Leo this so more squeaky toys done decided on these toys I think it's like dental toys and then to the cute the very cute things I got to this Hello Kitty top it was like 40 something grand for a piece of material but I doubt it's gonna fit them I think they're too big for this but in the moment it was super cute but we're gonna wait till we see the size before we buy them more um, clothes and it's summer so I don't want to put this on and she's gonna get hot and then the neighbor gifted us with it she gifted us with this cute little dress I think I showed you everything except the puppy food but if there's more things I'll just add it to this video but that's all for now that's my puppy haul and I'm super excited to show you guys the two Yorkies uh, that will probably be the next video that I will upload but that's it for this video thank you guys for watching and I'll see you next time